natron is a naturally occurring mixture of sodium carbonate decahydrate and about 17% sodium bicarbonate along with small quantities of sodium chloride and sodium sulfate. Natron is white to colorless when pure, varying to gray or yellow with impurities. Natron deposits are sometimes found in saline lake beds which arose in arid environments. Throughout history natron has had many practical applications which continue in the wide range of modern uses of its constituent mineral components. In modern mineralogy the term natron has come to mean only the sodium carbonate decahydrate which makes up most of the historical salt. Etymology the English word natron is a French cognate derived from the Spanish natra cubed and through Greek I one half I I I I one half nitron. This derives from the ancient Egyptian word nata the first a Y natron. Natron refers to Wadi al Nitron or Natron Valley in Egypt, from which natron was mined by the ancient Egyptians for use in burial rites. The modern chemical symbol for sodium, Na, is an abbreviation of that element's new Latin name natrium which was derived from natron. Importance in antiquity, historical natron was harvested directly as a salt mixture from dry lake beds in ancient Egypt and has been used for thousands of years as a cleaning product for both the home and body. Blended with oil, it was an early form of soap. It softens water while removing oil and grease. Undiluted, natron was a cleanser for the teeth and an early mouthwash. The mineral was mixed into early antiseptics for wounds and minor cuts. Natron can be used to dry and preserve fish and meat. It was also an ancient household insecticide, was used for making leather and as a bleach for clothing. The mineral was used in Egyptian mummification because it absorbs water and behaves as a drying agent. Moreover, when exposed to moisture the carbonate in natron increases pH, which creates a hostile environment for bacteria. In some cultures natron was thought to enhance spiritual safety for both the living and the dead. Natron was added to castor oil to make a smokeless fuel, which allowed Egyptian artisans to paint elaborate artworks inside ancient tombs without staining them with soot. The pyramid texts describe how natron pellets were used as funerary offerings in the rites for the deceased pharaoh, N. The ceremony required two different kinds of natron sourced from northern and southern Egypt. Smin, Smin opens thy mouth. One pellet of natron. O N, thou shalt taste its taste in front of the Zion and Tia chapels. One pellet of natron. That which horror spits out is smin. One pellet of natron. That which set spits out is smin. One pellet of natron. That which the two harmonious gods is smin. One pellet of natron. To say four times, thou hast purified thyself with natron together with Horus the followers of Horus. Five pellets of natron from Nikht, Upper Egypt. Thou purifiest. Horus purifies. One pellet of natron. Thou purifiest. Set purifies. One pellet of natron. Thou purifiest. Thou purifies. One pellet of natron. Thou purifiest. The God purifies. One pellet of natron. Thou also purifiest, thou who art among them. One pellet of natron. Thy mouth is the mouth of a sucking calf on the day of his birth. Five pellets of natron of the north, wadi natron. Natron is an ingredient for making a distinct color called Egyptian blue, and also as the flux in Egyptian faience. It was used along with sand and lime in ceramic and glass making by the Romans and others at least until 640 AD. The mineral was also employed as a flux to solder precious metals together. Equals decline in use equals, most of natron's uses both in the home and by industry were gradually replaced with closely related sodium compounds and minerals. Natron's detergent properties are now commercially supplied by soda ash, the mixture's chief compound ingredient, along with other chemicals. Soda ash also replaced natron in glass making. Some of its ancient household rolls are also now filled by ordinary baking soda, natron's other meaningful ingredient. Chemistry of hydrated sodium carbonate, natron is also the mineralogical name for the compound sodium carbonate decahydrate, which is the main component in historical natron. Sodium carbonate decahydrate has a specific gravity of 1.42 to 1.47 and a Mohs hardness of 1. 
it crystallizes in the monoclinic domatic crystal system, typically forming efflorescences and encrustations. The term hydrated sodium carbonate is commonly used to encompass the manuhydrate, the decahydrate and the heptahydrate, but is often used in industry to refer to the decahydrate only. Both the hepta and the decahydrate efflorescent in dry air and are partially transformed into the manuhydrate thermonate now 2 co 3 h 20 Equals as a source of soda ash equals, sodium carbonate decahydrate is stable at room temperature but recrystallizes at only 32 a degree Celsius to sodium carbonate heptahydrate, now 2 co 3 is 7 hours 20 then above 37 a euro 38 a degree Celsius to sodium carbonate manuhydrate. Now 2 co 3 h 20 This recrystallization from decahydrate to manuhydrate releases much crystal water in a mostly clear, colorless salt solution with little solid thermonate. The mineral natron is often found in association with thermonate, nithcolite, trona, halite, myrobolite, galocite, gypsum, and calcite. Most industrially produced sodium carbonate is soda ash which is obtained by calcination of sodium bicarbonate, sodium carbonate manuhydrate, or trona. Geological occurrence Geologically, the mineral natron as well as the historical natron are formed as transporoevaporite minerals, that is crystallizing during the drying up of salt lakes rich in sodium carbonate. The sodium carbonate is usually formed by absorption of carbon dioxide from the atmosphere by a highly alkaline, sodium-rich lake brine, according to the following reaction scheme, NaO, AC, plus CO2 and NaHCO3, AC, NaHCO3, AC, plus NaO, AC, and Na2CO3, AC, plus H2O, pure deposits of sodium carbonate decahydrate are rare. Due to the limited temperature stability of this compound and due to the fact that the absorption of carbon dioxide usually produces mixtures of bicarbonate and carbonate in solution. From such mixtures, the mineral natron will be formed only if the brine temperature during evaporation is maximally about 20 a degree Celsius a euro, or the alkalinity of the lake is so high, that little bicarbonate is present in solution a euro in which case the maximum temperature is increased to about 30 a degree Celsius. In most cases the mineral natron will form together with some amount of nithcolite, resulting in salt mixtures like the historical natron. Otherwise, the minerals tronal thermonate and nithcolite are commonly formed. As the evaporation of a salt lake will occur over geological time spans, during which also part or all of the salt beds might redissolve and recrystallize, deposits of sodium carbonate can be composed of layers of all these minerals. The following list may include geographical sources of either natron or other hydrated sodium carbonate minerals, Africa, Chad, shores of Lake Chad, Troyol natron, Era Kaha crater on Emikasi, Egypt, Wadi al Nitron, Ethiopia, Shoa Province, Niger, Bilma, Tanzania, Lake Natron, Europe, Hungary, Bar C. S. Kiskun County, Sebolg Satmarberek County, Italy, Campania, Province of Naples, Soma Vesuvius Complex, Kola Peninsula, Northern Russia, Kaibeni Massif, Lovo Zero Massif, Aluev Mountain, Kadikvapak Mountain, Umbo Zero Mine, England, UK St. Just District, Botalaka Euro Pendine Area. North America, Canada, Quebec, Rowerville County, Mont Saint Hilaire. Interior British Columbia. United States, California, Anio County. Nevada, Churchill County, Humboldt County, Mineral County. Oregon, Lake County. Pennsylvania, Carnes, Natrona. Washington, Okanagan County. Wyoming. Natrona County. See also, saltpeter, shortite, sodium sesquisarbonate, soda. References. External links, etymology of natron.